Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Nibiru channel. It is November 11th, 2016. And the photographs, the video, and the evidence just keeps pouring in. And we received a few more photographs of the Fresnel or Fresnel lens that me and Steve Olson and Jeff P uncovered in the Sun Simulator. One of our loyal subscribers driving down the road happened to notice this reflection in the sky. Literally pulled over and took these photographs. Now, I don't know how the sun can produce these types of lens flares other than the sun being produced and directed through this lens. The photographs are clear, folks. And we wanted to show this photograph once again. And this was taken at a Donald Trump rally not more than a week ago. And clearly shown in the background is a large planet reflection or refraction behind the crowd of people. Now, we also have several subscribers who do have telescopes and who are amateur astronomers. And they have been delivering photographs to us of clear planets in the sky. Now, I don't know why other amateur astronomers are not producing these types of photographs and making them public. Because the subscribers to this channel who do have telescopes or high-powered cameras are actually photographing these planets and they are sending them in to this channel. And these photographs are coming from all over the world. So, once again, like I have said before, it is very highly unlikely, dealing with the laws of probability, that all of these people in different countries and in different states across the globe are all coming up with broke down 10 cent camera photographs. And then, as we move to even clearer photographs of planets that are not associated with our solar system and that were taken by amateur astronomers, well, they're probably going to think that these photographs were faked. But these photographs are not faked. These are clear photographs of objects in our sky, above the Earth, and yes, there is a potential threat to Earth. Now, I have said this before, and once again, I will say it again. If these planets have an iron core, a molten core, then yes, they would be interacting with the Earth. But just like our moon, that is only 239,000 miles away, does not have a core. So therefore, the only interaction that it has with our Earth is the fluctuating tides. But, you know, I'm not an astronomer. I'm not a scientist. But that's as far as I know. So if these planets that are nearby do not have a core, therefore, they would not be causing problems here on Earth. However, if there is and was and there is a larger planet that we know as Nibiru, planet X, planet number 10, that does have a core and that is highly energized, much more than Earth, then yes, it will interact with the Earth. Now, these photographs, once again, were taken at the South Pole many years ago at the South Pole Observatory. Could you imagine standing there looking into the sky and seeing that planet? It must have been pretty shocking. Once again, folks, the evidence is there. The threat is real. It's time to wake up, start your own investigations, and like I always say, power is knowledge, and knowledge 
is power. We got this video from the International Space Station not more than 24 hours ago showing this beautiful fake sun rising above the earth mechanically. It doesn't even look real. And the bottom line is we know it's there. We've seen the lenses in all of the photographs and we are clearly seeing other objects near the earth in the photographs from ISS. And with that said, I'd like to thank all of our Nibiru watchers and subscribers. Your loyalty is greatly appreciated. I'd also like to remind you to make sure that you are subscribed to the Nibiru channel and share all of our videos with your friends and family members on Facebook and Twitter. And don't forget, you can still email your photographs and videos to NibiruPlanetX2016 at gmail.com. Your videos and photographs are very important. We would also like to remind you that you should come back to the Nibiru channel daily for all of our current updates. Create a bookmark or a direct link to the Nibiru channel, Planet X 2016. This is vital to stay informed. And as you go through life and your day to day, always remember, keep an eye in the sky.